and in today's video i'm going to talk about some of the must have figma plugins uh, that will improve your design workflow so without any further delay let's get started so first uh, plugin that i want to talk about is ui hurt basically it's a plugin in which you can find assets for your design that means it includes web templates illustrations mobile app kit web application kit 3d assets and icons so it has two different version one is paid and another one is free so in paid version you can have unlimited uh, ui kits icons illustration and in free plan you can have some of the kits illustration or icons because there are some limitations i can show you the plugin here you can find uh, so many things in this particular plugin you can uh, use these already created assets in your design that can really increase the speed of your design process so it was the first one first plugin that i want to talk about the next one is uh, it's a ui uh, sorry it's a AI plugin uh, which is very useful for UX writer because it helps you to uh, proofread all the content that you have added in your design also it helps you in co-writing that means you can rewrite the content content in your design so it's a wholesome uh, plugin for the UX writers I have discovered this particular plugin few months ago and I really liked it I use this uh, uh, every day and uh, I know not many of you have heard about it so I am sharing this with you uh, so it has two uh, features as of now which is co-writing and another one is proofreading so it is a plugin that uh, UX writers can use to uh proofread their content and also they can rewrite the content so let's jump to the next one which is auto name auto name is a plugin in which you can rename all the layers it's very useful when you have uh, multiple layers in your designs when you are working on the large project and there are uh, uh, 1000 plus layers so it is very useful it's a AI tool in which you can rename the layers you just have to uh, select the layer and type the name of the layer it is very easy so when you select the you just have to select the layers and press name it will automatically name your uh, given layers you you don't have to name them manually i will show you an example so what i will do is i will just uh, run this uh, figma plugin now i just have to select the layers and click on the name it's loading so now i will just select the layer I have selected these two layers and what I have to do is I will just click on name. See it will automatically rename the layers according to the layout or according to the content of that layer. Okay so it basically uses AI for renaming the layers. So it is very useful when you are working on the large projects large project in which uh, there are thousand plus layers so it is very useful plugin that you can have in your daily design work plugin i want to talk about is mockup uh, the mockup plugin contains wide collections of mockups that you can use in your designs i can show you the plugin it is free as well as uh, have a paid version so this is the uh, plugin mockup in which you can find uh, wide collections of mockups 
uh, for free as well as for pay as you can see it has opened and you can find various uh, beautiful um, mockups for your designs if i will if i select any of them let's just see if this is free or not just a second okay so i will just uh, pick up one of the screens from here just to give you an example just a second okay so now i will run this uh, plugin and select any one of the mockups so i have selected this mockup now i will select this uh, frame add your content by pressing plus okay you just have to select the screen then it will automatically add your screen to the mockup see how beautifully it added the screen to the mockup so it is very useful and it is very uh, it has a very wide collection of mockups that are very beautiful and it has paid version as well as well as there is a free version so you can opt for any one of them i usually prefer free versions so here you can find some beautiful mockups for free so you can try that and add this particular plugin to your daily design work talk about the next one it's a ai text generator tool which is called magic copy in which uh, you can have this uh, very good feature in which you can create marketing copy for landing pages in 14 different languages so i will show you the plugin you can try that in your design this is the plugin and basically it is used for the copywriting purposes if you are generating beautiful tag lines for your landing pages or maybe for your onboarding screens for the app so here you can see there are several options uh, industry blockchain you can change it to something else as well i will change it to stock market so here you can choose three copy types which is headline subtitle and feature i will select the headline and you can also select the tone of voice serious natural catchy i will select catchy and from here you can select different languages there are 14 languages to choose from i will select the english us and generate the copy just a second first of all you just have to select the text layer so that it can generate the copy so i have selected this uh, text layer and click on generate copy see it has uh, created this beautiful uh, headline for you which is catchy you can uh, select different option so that you can get different answer so you can see it has created this tagline which is start investing with stocks unlock your financial uh, potential today sometimes what happens uh, if client doesn't provide the content you have to create the content you have to create the tag lines for the tag lines or headlines for the landing page or onboarding screens so in that case this particular um, plugin is very useful so i hope you understood how you can use this particular plugin so let's just jump to the next one it is magician so basically it is a figma plugin that helps you in generating good micro copies unique icons from the text and also you can generate images with text 
because it's a AI plugin so you just have to type in your prompt and you can generate these things from it so it has a free plan as well and or it, it has some um, paid plan as well so I can see uh, I have uh, opened the website of magician so from here I will just click on the uh, try for free so that I can show you how you will use that So let me just log into this magician plugin. So this is the access key that I have to use while using that plugin. So I will just paste that access key here. Just a second. From here, you can generate magic icons, magic copy, magic rename. You can rename your layers as well. And you can also magic uh, image. You can also generate images. So I will show you example in which I will generate the magic icon. So I will just type in here trading. It is generating the icons based on the text I have typed in that search bar. See it has created, it has generated some of the icons for you to use. Okay, you can try different prompt here as well. So basically it's an AI plugin that will help you to generate micro copies, unique icons from the text and uh, AI generated images. So it is very useful in your day to day design work. So let's just jump to the next one. You can just try, uh, try out these options as well after watching this video. So let's just jump to the next one which is a auto flow. This is a very common plugin and I use it every day for my office work when I am creating flows for my designs. So here you can see this is a auto flow. Uh, so how you have to use it I will just tell you quickly. So you can also add shapes from here. There are different shapes and there are connectors and you can also add fonts different fonts to this uh, inside of this uh, image and also you can create flows you just have to connect two uh, frames for that so i will just duplicate this one now i will select both of them to uh, generate this connector see it has added this connector so basically it is used for creating flows user flows journey maps so you can use uh, this plugin for this for these purposes the svg motion it helps you to animate the solid line in your designs so basically it's an animating tool that will help you to create attractive animations for your product and also animates vectors that are solid lines i can yes this one is the plugin that i was talking about so if there are lines in your uh, design solid lines that it, then it will animate these designs in a beautiful parallax effect so you can also add different uh, lines from here as well See, there are so many options and it has uh, this pro version for, for that you have to pay. See, it will beautifully uh, animate the vector lines in your designs. 
you can use it for animations if you are uh, willing to pay for this kind of plugin that then it is worth it because it will beautifully uh, animate the lines so let us move to the next one which is color shades this plugin will help you to create different shades for the selected color so i will show you how this is the plugin and i will show you how it will create different shades for your uh, base color so i will select any of these colors and copy the color code and paste it here see how beautifully it has created so many shapes for the base color that i have added so it is useful when you are creating the color palette for your design and also creating the design system and you want different shades for that base color or primary color so it is very useful uh, when we are creating color palettes as you can see how beautiful shades it has created for me so you can use it in your daily design work uh, it will hopefully enhance your design workflow so let's just move to the last one which is very common uh, ui plugin i guess remove bg uh, i know uh, many of you have heard about this uh, you can use this for removing the backgrounds from your images it will really help you when you are uh, using images without the backgrounds and you can just go to this plugin and run the plugin so that it can remove the background from that particular image so that's all for today i hope this video find this video is helpful for you i have uh, researched uh, these uh, particular plugins that are very useful for your daily design work and if i have missed something if you want me to include some other plugin as well then let me know in the comment section and uh, i hope you all guys enjoyed this video and if you did then do not forget to subscribe to my channel for more such videos and hit that like button and do not forget to follow me on instagram and linkedin link is in the description and i will see you all in my next video bye bye